Hey, this is Fiber Home Michelle. Sorry I haven't been around in a while, but uh, for a couple of weeks I was up like a real person, almost. You know, uh, I still hurt a lot, but uh, was able to get up and do some things, and of course it wore me out and caused more pain, but I wanted to feel real. I wanted to do things, and I know you guys all know what I mean. I got a message uh, from a woman named Carla Reed. Her family just doesn't get it. And baby, girl, I know, do not try to get what you need from other people because you will never get it. Even if you think someone understands you, they don't. The people that are closest to us that we want to accept us, um, sometimes they can be the most brutal. And I know that because I'm not in touch with my mother or my brother or really anyone except my father and he still doesn't get it he thinks I can just snap out of it but you know I've snapped out of many things I'm on my seventh life I uh, I was a horsewoman was in uh, many accidents with horses then later I flew over a 300 foot cliff and climbed up it about 15-20 times with a broken back I've come back and forth and changed my life and moved all over the place. But you know, sometimes just this pain is here to stay. And you can go to different doctors and you can hope for different things and you can try every diet, which I have. Yes, raw foods to some of you that put those stupid idiot comments on. <laughs> An intelligent person that wants to feel good that wants to be productive will always search for an answer and with this type of pain there is no answer I finally thought I found one with uh, Dr. Dan Nancy Klimas they found that my white cells were like three or four times as many as they should be and they also found mono in my blood um, those are viruses viruses which they have no cure for so they wanted me to build my immune system with vitamins. Hey, I've never tried that before. Damn it, 20 years, you would have thought. Anyway, I did their exact thing, and I'm still doing it. And the stronger I get, the more pain I'm in. And uh, there's, uh, I don't know if you guys get them, but, you know, where there's a lot of pain, there's um, hard... Uh, knobs, balls between the skin and the skin gets very tight underneath them and it seems like it ties up the entire nerves and muscles and it centers down from that and things have been leading up to that but you know things get get harder as you've gone along I mean I started this in 1995 or maybe younger I believe I was a lot younger when it started but uh, Carla I want you to know you have my support because you may never have your family support. People that have never been in pain cannot understand yours. Even if you get someone that says to you, I understand and I want to help you, there's going to be those times when they have no idea what you're going through. Why you can't eat because your stomach uh, can't digest the food why you can't pick something up because you drop it because your hands hurt too much why you can't get up why you've soaked the uh, bed through you know people just aren't gonna get it so Carla Reed's family I don't know if I can help you guys because I can't help my own all I know is it's real and if you don't think it's real go to uh, Fibro Hell Michelle's page on YouTube there are so many people that write me. I get 10 letters a day of people that are happy that I've talked about the different symptoms that happen. That, you know, just when you think you've conquered one thing, something else comes along. And you're like, what the hell? What's going on? My feet have even grown. I always thought that somebody was pulling on my toes because it hurt, but now, yeah, my feet have even grown. So, all I can tell you, Carla, is you got to be strong in yourself. Any time that you can be your old self as a singer and a performer, go do it. Even if it's karaoke, even if you sing along with Glee, whatever the hell, just do it. 
you got to feel like who you were so you can be strong because uh, if we all kill ourselves like my sister did, it wasn't somebody in England I was talking about, it was my half sister. And my grandmother had it her whole life. And my younger brother died with a different form. And basically my whole family has a form, but they just, of course, will not listen to me, won't talk about it, won't think about it, and won't feel it. So, anyway, Carla, ah, I just dropped my computer. I hate when that happens. Anyway, Carla, this is Michelle, and I'm here for you. I hope your family will listen and understand that a kind word goes a long way. Um, I don't ever want to ask anyone to do anything for me. I'm just not like that. I've done everything for myself my entire life. I gave everything I could to my mom and her family, and they don't call me or talk to me. So, I don't know. My cholesterol now is at 1,200. Um, Every time I eat, it feels like uh, something's burning through me, and they said that's probably like a, uh, I forget, pancreatic attack. There we go, because your brain kind of goes to, you know. But, you know, there's some days you cannot get out of bed, but you want to, and those days that you can, you know you're going to pay for it. Just do it. Get out of bed, even if you know you're going to pay, but you will never be able to convince someone else of your pain. You know, ask somebody once in a while, what's the worst pain you've ever had? And you'll be amazed by what they say because you go, oh my God, that's nothing. But anyway, Fibro Hell Michelle, families, listen up. You know, we're not asking much. We just want you to believe us. It's a real disease. It's um, documented by many different physicians in many different ways. Yes, there are many forms of it, and we all want, don't have the same type of fibromyalgia or chronic fatigue, but it seems to me that the ones that get it are people that are very creative and people that want to help people, because those are the people that write to me, and we hate laying in bed. We want to be out doing things, so if you don't believe us, well then, we have to believe in ourselves and each other. Have a good night. This is Fibro Hell Michelle. Thanks.